you take the food waste and process it somehow because it, otherwise it's going to get contaminated with the uh, micro uh, uh, football pathogen. You process it somehow with a fermented or dry or do other things. And then you you generate a chemical uh, a mixture that is called we call an I meal, which is an insect meal if you like, to bring it to a level where the insect will take it. And eventually you convert that into animal protein through this uh, insect. An alternative is part of the fermentation that you have in here is a liquid which is rich in nutrients, which we call a leachate. We use that to grow uh, to grow algae. You will see it. it's a we grow uh, synodesmus. Now uh, the leachate itself, okay, is that's how much leachate you create as you ferment food waste, probably up to 400 to 500 liters per every metric ton of food waste. The leachate itself ends up in two mega products. One, we can use the leachate to produce melanin, which is a very high value, but there is no market for it yet. It's high value because, you know, people try to extract it from squid, and a lot of uh, companies are using it for pigments, dyes, and all that. But I think we think the best application for this particular class of melanin is in batteries, not in cosmetics. And there is also some of this liquid can be used to, to grow uh, to grow algae. It's a particular.